friends and welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I have a haul for you all. I got my coffee, I got a giant pile of clothes next to me, I got some records, I got some books, I got just various stuff, you know? And I'm really hyped right now, I'm really excited to show you guys. So honestly, this might be a pretty long video. So I would suggest going to grab maybe a beverage, maybe a snack, maybe a friend to watch it with, you know? And just, let's get into the haul. Okay, we're gonna start off with clothes first, cause I love clothes. And I mean, you guys already know that I love clothes, you know? I have so many hauls that I've been uploading recently and it's just, I have a shopping problem, an addiction, if you will. And I don't think I'm proud of it, but like I'm open to saying that I have this problem. Anytime I'm bored, I online shop. So that's basically what I did with this uh, first store. So I went to Lazy Oaf, where my computer found itself on lazyoaf.com and um, I got these trousers and I think they're so fucking adorable. They're kind of more wide-legged. I'm gonna try these on so you guys can kind of see how all of these clothing items fit. I just love the pattern on them and it has like this weird little patch in the back near the butt too but like I don't know I kind of like it it adds to the character yeah these are just great they're a nice dress pant you know next I have a hoodie to show you that so many of you have been asking where I got it from and it was lazy oaf what a shock my new favorite brand honestly but I just love it because it says sorry I'm late on kind of like the breast over here and then the back has this cool looking face on it and I just love the coloring I don't have too many plain white hoodies you know so I figured this one was the one it was the one for me the next thing I got was this cute little pinstriped either shirt if you're tall or dress if you're short like me and I actually wore this in some Twitter pictures recently if you guys were wondering where I got this from but it has a cute little strawberry man with like a little cute nose on the front up here and yeah like I said it's just pinstriped it's a nice like lavender color I would say and I just love it all right this next shirt I wore in my why I don't wear a bra video and so many of you were commenting being like why do Americans say bollocks so weird because I said it like bullocks I'm just an American idiot you know in the words of Green Day and then the last item that I got from here was this potty mouth little t-shirt and I just love ringer tees it's so cute with the pink around the neck and the arms and I love this little design after I bought this Lindsay actually like showed me the stuff that she bought online from Lazy Oaf and she had gotten the same thing and I was like dang it but we wear the same stuff all the time so classic but yeah that's everything I got from there now moving on all right these next two things that I got are from a store called vignettes and their handle is vignettes underscore Augusta on Instagram so I'll put it on the screen here if you guys want to follow them and check out their stuff and whatnot because I got so many comments on like snapchat and you guys asking me on Twitter um, where I got this top from because it says peachy keen and it's nice little ringer tee like the last one I just showed you and this is just so adorable and so cute and it makes me feel like a little Georgia peach again you know and then I also got these cute little shorts and they have such a cool design on them I just love all of the colors and they're just so bright and summery you know I know summer's like kind of coming to an end but still great shorts okay now we have my stuff from free people and I got like three items from them. So the first thing is just this dress and I've been wearing this a ton on Instagram recently and I just love it so much. I love the coloring with my hair color. It's a nice like forest green kind of like canvasy color. Canvas? That's not what I'm trying to say. Anywho's, I just love this dress. It has pockets, which is always a plus. It has buttons all the way down the front. It really sucks my girls in and it just like makes me look kind of flattering, you know? It's just a flattering dress. Everyone needs a nice flattering dress. The next thing I got is what a shock, another bodysuit. I literally have an addiction, I have a problem, but this one is just so comfy. The material is so soft, it's unreal. And the last thing that I got, I probably got back in like May when I was still home in Georgia, but it's this nice little cropped sweater. Well, actually it's like a cropped hoodie. It's got the hood on there, it's got a nice zipper. I just love the way that this fits and looks. I actually got this because my friend Claudia was like posting a bunch of photos in it. And so I asked her where it was from. She told me it was from Free People. It took me so long to find it on the website. So if I can find it, I'll link it down below for you guys. But if not, it might be sold out. But yeah, this is great, especially for California because it doesn't really get cold here. So a nice cropped sweater that doesn't really make you too hot is just a one. All right, so the other week, Lindsay and I went to Abbott Kinney here in California. If any of you live in like, you know, the Venice area or around Venice in general, go to freaking Abbott Kinney. It's so cute. So many shops, so many restaurants, so much to do. It's just adorable. So yeah, we went to this place called Principessa in Abbott Kinney or on Abbott Kinney Boulevard and they're having a really big sale. So I ended up getting this like jumpsuit type thing and I just love floral patterns and these nice, beautiful colors. Like pastels are just my shit. And I got it for a lot less than it was originally 
originally marked for, so woohoo! And I only got one thing from there, so now we're gonna bounce into stuff that I got more recently. So I shopped online at Reformation, and they were having like 40 or 60% off sale items, so I just went insane. Well, not really insane, because their stuff is pretty pricey. So I got like two things. The first thing I got being this black silk dress with some lace detailing at the top. It's super sexy and super cute, and it has some creases in it from the package, because I literally just got this stuff. It like still has the freaking tag on it. But I've just been wanting a silk dress for so long for some reason, and I finally found just the perfect little guy. And then the last thing I got is this two-piece set. So first we have this off-the-shoulder top, and I actually wore this to FYF Fest that I went to this past weekend. And then the matching pants to this are super cute as well, and they're just the same design, obviously, because they're matching. <laughs> But the only regret that I have about these pants is I got them in a size too big, so I have to get them altered around to fit my waist now. That's why most of the time I try to avoid ordering pants online because then they're final sale if you buy them on sale and you can't return them and basically that's what happened with these. So now I just gotta get them, you know, freaking taken in. But cute pants, love the set. All right, now our last clothing place that I'm gonna be showing you stuff from is golfwing.com. You guys know I love Tyler the Creator, he's great. So anyways, Tyler dropped a new line of um, golfwing stuff and I just loved the coloring because it's literally my two favorite colors were like the main colors in the collection so sky blue and freaking yellow man look at these boxers I'm not even a boy but I'm going to wear these very often because one look at the band a beautiful sky blue has golf imprints all over it and I just love this color yellow as well they're so bright and happy and I don't know I want to wear these underneath like boyfriend jeans or really just wear them as shorts all of the things that I got are in the exact same color palette honestly so uh, this next thing I got is this golf top and it has like a 3d kind of printed design on the front I honestly have a t-shirt collecting problem like I'll film my entire box of t-shirts over here that I have to find a dresser for because that's every t-shirt I own and like it's uncanny how many I have so naturally I figured why not buy another one you know but really I just love golf wing quality t-shirts like these t-shirts and the ones from teenage clothing like boardteenager.com those ones always stay in just impeccable condition like you can tell that they really put a lot into the brand and like make it a good quality tea. So that's what I love about this. So yeah, I got that and then I got these kind of to like match it but also wear on their own. And I know that they're like a super funky and out there design but I actually made like a poll on Twitter and I was like, go look at my Snapchat. I just took a picture of these pants. Let me know if I should get them. And so many of you were like, yes. So I was like, okay. And here they are, man. It's just a nice flame trouser. And I got the smallest size if you're wondering and wanting to get them for yourself. I don't know if they're still up for sale on golfwing.com, but either way, you guys should check out golfwing.com because they have great stuff. And then the last thing I got is not a clothing item. It's just this little card holder slash my new wallet. It has some nice little engraved designs on the front and the back, and it's just A1. Love that thing. All right, now I have two books to show you guys that I recently got off of Amazon. So the first one is Amy Schumer's new book, and I love this woman so much. Her show, Inside Amy Schumer, I watch all of the time. But yeah, shout out to Amy. I'm just really excited to read this. I wanted to haul it before I did read it for some reason, but if I really enjoy this, then I'll talk about it in like a books I love video because a lot of you have been requesting that too. And I would love to film something like that, honestly. So yeah, when I finish this, I'll definitely let you guys know how I feel about it. And then this next book is actually more of like a coffee table book and I showed it on Snapchat, but it's Golf Wang's um, picture book kind of from like 2011. It says Golf Wang down the binding over here and then has a nice little picture of some skater boys out on the front here. And I think the only reason I found out that this even existed is because I was watching some like old interview from Tyler or something like that and they showed footage from like the Golf Wang book signing so I was like what? Golf Wang has a book? Since when? And so then naturally I googled it and I came across this and it was on Amazon and it was like being sold by somebody who had already used it so like kind of the corner is a little turned up over here and it definitely has a little bit of wear to it but I still love it and I think it's great so yeah just something to flip through when I actually get a coffee table. And then another thing that I bought on Amazon actually lets me, you know, kind of continue into this next part of the haul, which is all records. And the first one I got is Frank from Amy Winehouse, and oh my god, is this the best thing in the whole entire world. Look at this goddess of a woman. 
Look at her, she's just great. I had always listened to this album on like Spotify and stuff like that, but now I have it just to listen to on vinyl and it's great. And then the rest of these records I got at Amoeba Music here in LA, which is just the freaking best record store and like biggest one ever. It's where I get most of my records, but anywho's, I got this one because it's uh, one of my mom's favorite albums. This is Blue from Joni Mitchell and I just love this woman. I love this album, I think it's great. I love me some oldies, you know? Okay, this next record is honestly one of the best R&B albums of all time in my opinion and this is from the internet, it's their Ego Death album. And I bought this like on iTunes, but I decided the last time I was listening to it on my phone that I just needed it on vinyl. And so that is exactly what I got. And it has like these little doggies on the back cover. And like I said, I just freaking love this album, it's great. I'm sorry if you hear any kind of sawing noise that just started, but I'm just gonna keep talking through it. The next record that I wanted to get was a record from Mac Miller. And honestly, I really just wish that I could get watching movies with the sound off on vinyl. I know that there's a version of it online that you can order that's from some random like German website or some shit. But I just want him to make like an OG watching movies with the sound off vinyl. But that was from like 2013, so obviously he's not gonna go back and make that. So I was like, you know what? I'll settle for his most recent album, which was Good I Am, which I love anyways. It's a great album. I fucking love Mac Miller. He's like one of my favorite rappers of all time. And honestly, he's the guy who like got me into rap music when I was in like fucking seventh grade. So yeah, it just has his face on the front, the back of his head on the back, and I just really rock with that album. And now we have one of my favorite albums that has recently come out and it's this one from The Avalanches and my friend Billy told me about this and it's just one of like the greatest and most like unique sounding records that I have. And I'd been listening to it a lot on Apple Music but I hadn't gotten it obviously on vinyl. And then when I was at Amoeba and I saw this, I literally screamed out loud. Like I scared the guy next to me. He was like, oh, okay. And I'm so glad that I got it. There's a really good song on here called Frankie Sinatra and it has like Danny Brown on it and it's just fucking bomb. You guys should definitely go and check that album out. But the last one that I got is from the Fugees and it's their score album or the score album It's really good, but also there's a lot of like yelling in the intros and like outros of the vinyl Which is weird, but I don't know man. I enjoyed it musically These are all a hit for me right now and all of the clothing items that I got are really a hit for me right now as well So I hope you guys enjoyed this gigantic like collective haul of just random shit as well as a bunch of clothing And yeah, man, I just hope you liked it if you did please give it a big thumbs up for me. Subscribe if you are not already because I'm about to hit 400k and I would just love if you could help me get there. So yeah, man. Okay, have a great day. Bye. Stay smiling. <laughs> red run, red run, ay. Hood line, I'm done, yeah. Dust done, hell spine, whoa. Melty Cannon saved the game. Yeah. Rock with it, lean with it, start